Guys, this class I would like to tell you how to do in the whole uh, functions. So let's go into the sketch and in the top view, top line, and we just could draw a rectangles, and then we're going to extrude. Extrude is maybe a it drag is to twenty four. So hit it. Okay. Um, and then. I hit it the hole and let's just keep the tab is general hole but you could change to a uh, different tabs of the hole and in specify point let's hit it the surface we want to uh, draw a hole uh, as a base ply so let's hit it this ply Steve default is just to give a point we could also click the left mouth button to draw a uh, several uh, pointing here and then we could use repeat dimensions to change the dimensions of the hole for examples I would change to a 20 and then in here I would give a The give is 30. So I could redefine the position of this this point. And also I could generate it the rest of the point locations. Right. Okay, let's hit it finish. And default is the diameters, the from is samples. I we could also change the contour board, contour sunk, different types of the hole. And at this moment, let's just uh, uh, keep it samples here. And in here is a diameter. So it's default is 25 millimeters. We could change to a smaller. For example, we change to a 10. So you could see the hole, the diameter of the hole has become smaller. And the deep limited is um, its default is values. So we could change to a 25. So it's not go through. Oh, it's already go through. So if you change to a 10, so those three holes not go through um, of this outside object. We could also change the tape angles into a more sharp corners here. So it's default to subtract because you want to draw a hole on this object. So you don't necessarily to be changed to another. Let's just keep a subtract. And let's hit it apply. Okay, so if I doing a sketch in this ply, uh, or we could um, go into a date and ply, and in date and ply we hit it this ply as a base, and then we could uh, generate another ply. Let's give it ten. So let's hit it OK. So we right click, uh, double click and then drag this plies to become uh, larger so we could uh, visible this ply. OK, and then if we go into a how again, in that moment, I also click on this surface. And yeah, this is a good position. Let's close it and click finish. And the, in this situation, if I change to four, uh, sorry, if I change to a value into until selected, we could choose this plane. So you could see this hole is just a reach to this plane and then stop, right? 
And if I change to until next, it's not calculate the plane. It's only calculate the surface, the shades, the face of the object. And the same is um okay for examples um and i redraw a sketch on here do it extrude opposite way selected body and hit it okay so we generated this object okay and then i go into a hull and then i click on this at that moment i just hit it finish okay so um the in in the values if i choose until next you could say this hull is just a reach that to a next surface on the object not ply it's not calculate so if you choose until next is not calculate the ply you created it's only calculate the surface the shape at the surface of the body the face of the body and the shape right if i change to go through the body you could see the hose all the way go to through to the last surface of the body. Let's hit it. Apply. And also, if I click a sketch on this ply, and on this ply, I draw a this line, right? Okay, so this time, if you go into a hole, I also draw on this ply. This time, I hit it close and finish and double click uh, okay so default is normal to the face if i choose to align vectors i choose this line this is the face plane to normal if i change to this plane okay if yeah, so in here, we just need to change from face plane normal, change to a curve axis vectors. And default is this. So the direction is cut to the top, to this direction. So let's just reverse this and hit it. Apply. You're going to got this hull with some angles okay guys today or oh, we're tutorial about how to draw a hull on an object is just to finish if you like my video just uh, subscribe to my channel and see you next class bye